Hey guys, um, I just woke up. It's hard for me to wake up early in the morning as much as I could when I get a chance. I just sleep all the way. Today, I'm making this video because we got notified yesterday about this display cabinet that we've been wanting to buy. And it is called the D12 um, Fully Glass display cabinet this morning rob went to ikea and, and buy it right away and i hope we could cover the video and we could show you how it looks like and at the same time see the finished product the display is actually gonna go this side of the wall one over there and then another one by the end and i'm gonna put the hot wheel that he owns for years now and then some shelves underneath so I can have some place to put my model kits once i'm done right now i'm waiting for him to come home i'm gonna show you some of the items that i ordered from ikea i ordered the shelf originally online together with some light that goes with it they canceled the glass display because apparently it's so popular that they just want it to be sold first come first serve but the lights came in and i'm actually gonna show you how they look like I decided to buy six of the lights. One package of the light is like this. It comes with two in it. It came like this. So yeah, we're gonna wait for Rob to arrive. I'm gonna show you how it looks like. Then we're gonna show you how we're gonna build it. friendly? Depends. <laughs> really? There's, there's a difference. Put them there. Sure. Here are your two shows. Here's your mini show. is the light that I bought for the shelf and it comes in two lights inside. I bought six of them and I thought I'm gonna be getting six. Now I have 12 pieces in total. So be careful but they're very inexpensive though. I opened one of the boxes and it comes like this. They're this small. Oh But looks like this. Good amount of light but it's this small. or the bottom but We broke one. Broke one. Broke one shelf. It's only one shelf. It didn't really break the ones for the walls. We could still make it work. Lesson learned. Uh, open the boxes laying flat on the floor, not standing up like this. One of the shelves slid to the bottom and it broke. It shattered. Like it's literally down there but it's okay because he has some action figure that's taller so that's fine we could still make it work okay yeah, now i know how to open them now see well we know that's the top this is the bottom okay
This is the direction the door's gonna open? Yes. Okay. Since we broke one of the shelves, we're not going to put anything in the bottom. We're going to build the other one and I'm going to cut it from here and I'm going to show you with both of them built. It's pretty much going to be the same process. I'm going to get back to you once we finish the second one. So we're done with the second glass cabinet. Rob is just installing the, the rubber stuff and the, the shelves. We did a little bit of adjustment with the closet cabinet because it opens that way and we want to put the cabinet right here we're gonna put both of the glass cabinets on both ends over there and over there and we're gonna put something in the middle I think it was just, it just needed both sides. Next thing we're gonna do is put this hot wheel shelf in the middle. put the hot wheel I, found it. I made it myself underneath we're gonna put those two shelves and then we're gonna finish it off by putting all the action figures that we need to put and that will be it for the project and the lights we're gonna install the lights empty right now but we're gonna show you later um, once we put everything in there and then the final touches will be the light and we're gonna reveal it once we're done so we're gonna get back to you in a few so we're back so here it is there goes the glass cabinet over there the hot wheel the only thing that's missing is the trophy that uh, supposed to go here but I was putting some backlighting when I turn all this on that one is um, left out like it's a little dark in there so I'm trying to make something work for the lighting for the trophy there goes all of his um, collection they're not much but he values them very much let's see how it looks like so here goes the finished um, product of this whole project everything that i bought 
for the whole setup the whole LED setup I think it's around um, it's less than a hundred I also bought zip ties and extension cord it's kind of fancy look one puck light off two puck light off and then the LED But like I said, this is something extra. For me, I prefer doing that. If you guys like this video, hit the like button and um, subscribe if you want to because we have a lot of other projects that we'll be doing. Hit the notification button, like or dislike. Dislikes are fine. And um, just see you in the next video.